everywhere and attempted to answer the question, Who is Jesus? Feminists have often said that Jesus was a woman as one. He, he had to beat the crowd at a moment's notice when there was no food. Two, he kept trying to get a message across to a bunch of men. He just didn't get it. Three, even when he was dead, he still had to get up and because there was more work to be done. Others read things differently, like my friend Blackman, who thinks that Jesus was a really cool dude with a great sense of humor. He enjoyed long walks in Jerusalem and liked eating pizzas and cream while watching the sunset. The image I have chosen is this casting depiction of Jesus, which was taken from the greatest television series of all time, Simpsons. Um, it came from the episode Simpsons, um, Simpsons Christmas Story, which is a collection of biblical stories um, that have been interpreted by the writers of the series. It is a contemporary image as it is in a cartoon format with bright colors and, is, and has been digitally animated. It is a representation of a part of popular culture which makes it more relevant to society today and as the, they came from the show The Simpsons, it also makes it more familiar to us. It makes the story easier to understand as it is simple and appealing to a younger audience who will carry on the Catholic faith. Um, <laughs> has Jesus in the middle there with a halo which signifies his importance and shows that he's in a transcendent dimension, also shows that he's like supernatural. And he's surrounded by bright colors, um, glowing and is encircled by people which also signifies his importance. Um, the story of Jesus' birth is well known in the Bible as it is um, in the Gospels of Matthew and Luke, um, it, um, each of them having their own interpretation of the story. As a result, um, the story can be interpreted in many different artistic formats, which may or may not be similar to the one in this picture. Um, according to the scripture, Jesus was a man, whether you look at it from a historical or religious viewpoint. Um, he was made of flesh in the image of man, born of the Virgin Mary. He had to live, breathe, and die as a man, whether he could have asked for salvation at any given moment of his torment. However, he chose to feel the pain of mortals by suffering on the cross so that we may live in everlasting life. The scriptures and Catholic Church's teaching on the birth of Jesus are similar as he was born of the Virgin Mary with Joseph as his stepfather. He was the son of God. He was born in a stable in Bethlehem. Um, three wise men and shepherds came to visit um, bringing gifts. Um, this image is relevant to contemporary Australian Christians as it um, strikes a chord with us as it is familiar. Um, as it comes from the Simpsons, it puts it into a daily context. And the birth of Jesus is usually only portrayed um, one way, whereas this image gives um, a different perspective or viewpoint. Um, it gives humorous light, making it not as serious, which is a good thing, even though some mothers may disagree. <laughs> um, as it would appeal to many different types of people, um, as entertainment plays a significant role in society today. Um, I'm a theologian, so I cannot, um, so I do not know who or what Jesus is. Um, therefore, I cannot really answer the question of who he was. No matter how much we study Christology, we will never have a definite answer um, to who Jesus was, which makes the question very difficult to answer. Um, however, with gaining an understanding of readings and teachings of Jesus, we will begin to gain a greater understanding of who he was, of who he might have been. But most importantly, we must remember that Jesus was a super cool fellow. Thank you.